All right, tubers. So, got a quick live stream for you guys. Mainly because Milo is being super, super cute right now. I was trying to play some Star Wars Racer on the PNP Pentium 3 computer here, but Milo seems to have other plans. Um, I just finished the, let's see, what was that level? The Sunken City level. And barely, because Milo decided to jump up. Now, you see I have all this stuff sitting right here. This is to kind of try to block him from coming up, but he's smart. He'll actually jump from the ground onto the table here, onto the back of this chair, and then onto the computer. Aren't you a silly cat, Milo? What are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> he he could stay here for like at least 20 30 minutes i'm telling you this cat is so kooky what you doing now I have to be careful because he will try to bite cords yeah yeah hey mom you want to come in here for a minute I'm the end of this, yeah 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 trying to get mom in here to see this what what are you doing yeah. If you fall off, Milo, I better get a super chat. <laughs> LOL. Hey, everybody. You guys haven't heard from me in a while, so I figured I'd go ahead and give you at least a little bit of an update. And Milo gave me the perfect excuse. Yes, you did. Huh. Now, nah, see, I got to watch him. No, can't bite that. Can't bite that, baby. Uh, uh, no, no, no. It's one thing I don't want him near the power supply. That's 120 volts of raw power. No. You know what he likes? He likes the heat that comes from the power supply. Don't you unplug that. Don't you. No. No. Ooh. He's getting feisty with me, aren't you, Bud Bud? Yes, you are. Yeah, he, you know, uh, 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 no, okay, come on, Mido, Whew. I gotta refocus his attention elsewhere, Mido, Mido, Whew. come on, Mido, come on, Mido, I could hear his whisker getting caught in the fan, I may have to shut this computer off, tubers, I really don't want him to, uh, I don't want him to get hurt, but, oh, stinker, oh, <gasps> Yes, you are. I hope everybody's having a happy Easter. I hope you guys went to church today. I did this morning. The whole family did. We heard a great message from our pastor all about what Easter is. And I don't know if a lot of you guys know this. Easter is the day that Christ rose, not the day that he was crucified. That was actually Good Friday. Yep, Easter is the day we celebrate his his arisal to heaven and that was basically three days after. I know, he's cute, isn't he? Good boy, Milo. I'm sorry if you guys don't like uh, the Christian talk. That's I am a Christian, so that will be part of this channel sometimes, you guys. If you want to tune out, that's okay. I hope you don't. hope you guys listen to a little bit of it, because uh, it is important. There's uh, a lot of bad things that happen in the world today, and uh, you definitely need to lean on the Lord sometimes. And that uh, right, my low, yeah. Well, we got his attention refocused quickly. Good boy, my low. Good boy. See, let's see if he'll do it. Oh wow, he actually jumped. <laughs> you are so funny. And now he's gonna knock over my uh, KVM switch over here, aren't you, bud? Click, 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 click. Stephen Barber says, Happy Easter to you. And yes, lots of people forget the true meaning of the day. It's not about candy or Easter bunnies. It's about our Lord and Savior who died for our sins. Absolutely. Do they do? Yes, we do. Uh, Sam asked, do, they, do we do Easter eggs in the U.S.? Yes, but mostly for kids. I haven't done them in about 20 years, showing my age. I'm getting loved on. Look at this. 
Mom's coming in. You want to say hi? We're doing a live stream. Oh, hello. What you doing? You just chilling. Are you just chilling? Are you just chilling? You just chilling, aren't you? Oh, I'm getting cleaned. I know. He's being a real stinker. He was on top of my uh, computer oh, you're so there. You'd be so silly. He wants attention. He needs some attention. I know That's he does. All. Everybody's saying hi to you. Hello. <laughs> Mom's doing just fine. I haven't done a, uh, any kind of video in like almost five days. So. Wow. That's unusual. Yeah. So I figured I'd do an update. That's unusual. Look at him. He's just chilled. You're a happy cat, he aren't so you? so chilled. Yeah. I know. <laughs> He's very happy up there. Yes, he is. So happy. Yes, you are. Well, oh, now I'm going to get bit. He'll do that he, sometimes. You know what he likes to do? I don't know why. You know, I have my long nails. He loves yeah. chewing on my nails. When I go in the one, he wants to chew. See? Look, look, look. He'll start chewing my You're nails. You're going to chew on mom's nails? Now he's making a liar out of me. Look at that butt. Look at that big butt in the air. What's that big butt doing in here? You can chew it? Yep. See, he chews on her nails. Mom's got, what do they call these nails? Acrylic. See, 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 see? He'll start chewing on my nails. Oh, <gasps> you silly. You're so funny. You think you're so funny. Yes, you do. Oh, yeah. That doesn't feel very good. He's yeah. purring, I think. You're so silly, yeah. I don't know. Hi, buddy. Know. Hi, buddy. I can't tell if he's purring or not. I don't know. You're a YouTube star, Milo. <laughs> what a little stink pot. He is. Whoa, whoa, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, what happened, bud? I don't know. He decided to get down for some reason. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> Was it say, uh... Sam's ginger cat is also called it's called Halo. Oh, Halo! Like oh, the I game. Like that. I yeah, like, like that the name. like the Xbox game. That's Halo. A really cute name, Halo. I yeah, like it that. is. We had such a hard time picking out his name. I wanted Finn, and Matt hated it. Yeah, so, and I and I wanted. Well, I can't even remember. I don't What's remember what you wanted. I don't remember, but we didn't I, like I can't either. remember now either. Yeah. Uh, okay. Where's Baxter? Well, I don't call know. Him my half the time. My or my my. My my. Oh my my. Oh my. Like my. when he's being bad, we say, "Oh, oh my, my my, it's Milo." Yeah. yeah. Oh Milo. <whistles> what? 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 Uh, my my. Oh my my. Oh my 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 though. Uh, he just wants to clean. Well, I'm gonna go. I gotta call a friend of mine. All right. Say All right, bye. 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 Let me turn you guys around here. There you go. You guys can kind of see me a little bit better there. Um, again, I really didn't plan this. I He was being so cute. I literally had the phone in my hand answering a message from Eric Brunhammer. And I said, oh, you know what? Let's go ahead and do a quick live stream to give you guys an update on what's going on. Um, doing okay. A lot better now that the pollen is gone for the longest time. I was having a hard time breathing because of all the pollen. Like, my chest was filled, and I was, like, wheezing. If I laid down at night, I was drowning in my own mucus. There were a few nights that I actually had to sleep sitting up, which, if you guys know me, I absolutely hate doing that. I cannot sleep when I'm sitting up, so I wasn't really able to sleep much those nights at all. Um, but now it's a lot better. We've had several nights of very heavy rains, and um, that's pretty much washed all the pollen away, and my allergies are just great. Every once in a while, um, you know, maybe two or three times a week, I do take some of the Benadryl allergy medicine. This is the uh, Assured brand. This is what I get from Dollar Tree. They're Diphenhydramine HCI 25 milligram tablets, and these are a dollar for 36, so not a bad deal. These are safe to take in moderation. Um, you, they're not addictive for the most part. I guess some people, everything's addictive. Um, and they're good for helping you sleep. You never want to take Benadryl during the day because it will make you drowsy. You know, they have the daytime, nighttime allergy meds. This is definitely nighttime allergy relief. Um, let me see. Somebody was asking me something. Da, 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 da. Max O'Neill, I've ate way too much chocolate today, LOL. I actually have not eaten any chocolate today. Um, I'm trying to be good because over the past few days, I've actually kind of been bad. Um, let me see. I had uh, Friday, I had an ice cream from uh, Rick's in Portsmouth. I had the strawberry shortcake. And then Saturday, what did I have Saturday? 
Oh, I had a piece of ice cream cake on Saturday, and then today we went out to Red Lobster, and I tried to be good there. When I went to Red Lobster, I got the uh, Cajun uh, Alfredo, Cajun chicken Alfredo. It's like fettuccine Alfredo, but just a little bit thinner. Um, and you have the option to get the full portion or the half portion. Now, the full portion is 1,320 calories. The half portion is 620, so I opted to get the uh, 620 calorie half portion. And believe it or not, it's actually quite a bit of food. That actually fills me up just fine. So I had that. I had four of the uh, Cheddar Bay Biscuits, pretty small ones. Usually I have three, but for whatever reason, they were really small this time. So I wound up getting four. And then um, I had a bowl of the lobster bisque, and that was it. And that was literally it. Like, I didn't eat anything else. Other than that, I had uh, my oatmeal and a banana and coffee for breakfast. And that's all I've eaten all day. And I'm not going to eat again until tomorrow morning. Uh, I know I said I'm not really going to do the intermittent fasting too much anymore. Um, but when I do eat a lot like that and a big dense, uh, a calorie dense meal, I will fast, uh, on those days. And that'll be, let's see, I had that last meal around two and I won't eat again until probably eight tomorrow morning. So see, that's 12, 30, 40, 15, 17, that's 18 hour fast there. And it's good to do that every once in a while because, again, it lets your body work through all that food that you've eaten throughout the day. And especially if it's a, a celebration day like Easter or Thanksgiving, Christmas, where you know you're going to eat a lot of food, you definitely want to fast the next day. Stephen Barber says, I've been playing with my Gateway. It now runs XP Pro Gateway Edition, and the Dell has 98 Dell OEM. Both are doing good. Yeah, um, it, it, it's funny. I can't do that with this computer because this is a, a custom-built system. Um, I was going to do that with the uh, the the Dell XPS D233, D233, the Pentium 2 system I have, but that computer was designed to run Windows 95, Unfortunately, uh, I guess fortunately for me, I decided to put Windows 3.1 and DOS on there, so I really don't have any option for a um, like an OEM release. If I ever do decide to upgrade that to Windows 95, I'll probably look for the Dell recovery disks that originally came with that system, because that would be interesting to see what kind of software was bundled with that originally. They just decided to tell him about the live stream. Well, don't worry about it, Eric. I didn't. Uh, I didn't really advertise this or anything, so that's probably why. That's why you guys did not get any um, alerts. This was a surprise. Yes, Chris, I am using my glasses again. I actually don't need to. Believe it or not, I can actually see pretty well without them. Um, but during allergy season, my eyes get a little bit more blurry, and that's why I'm wearing them right now. Probably not going to wear them all the time, though. Like, when these finally break, I'm not going to even bother getting a new prescription unless I absolutely have to. Aren't those OEM Windows 90X CDs all on the Internet? Yes. Uh, they're on mostly on Abandonware sites. I think Abandonware.com, and there are a few other ones out there. Um, yeah, you can get that stuff. As long as the operating system is considered abandonware, then yeah, generally you can get them on, on those sites. The geek? Okay. George Stewart asks, you haven't been to any thrift stores lately? I actually have, honestly. Um, I just haven't really felt like doing any thrift store haul videos. I, I, I'm sorry about that, guys. It's just, with the way my allergies have been feeling and just some personal things going on, nothing bad, but just a lot of... Um, other things happening i just haven't had the time and or the motivation to do them but they will be coming back um i'm gonna start back doing those maybe in the next week or so i'm hoping uh monday or tuesday we're gonna go and pick up another bike yes we're gonna pick up another bike for dad and i'll probably hit some thrift stores when i go down there and if i find anything interesting i'll go ahead and do a uh, a thrift store haul video a lot of the stuff I've been finding recently, too, is just the kind of stuff you guys have seen a hundred times. Keyboards, mice, monitors. 
Uh, nothing interesting. And if I don't have anything interesting to film, I'd rather not film a video because I don't want things to get repetitive. To me, that just gets really, really boring. <laughs> All right, tubers, I'm actually going to end this live stream. This was only ever going to be a real short one. I hope you guys are having a great Easter Sunday. Go ahead and spend some time with your family. Please continue to like and subscribe.